Good morning and welcome to Skill by Day, wherever, where I take different skills, try to get better at them. This is just the beginning, so currently the skill is art. And um, I've got mixed feelings about my art. Anyway, uh, today we're going to go ahead and finish up with the second tutorial by our Polish friend Monica Zagobelna. It's a tough one. So let's go ahead and open up the canvas. All right, so I've been taking shape so far. I've been scaling them, rotating them, and so forth. Today, what we're going to be doing is taking a smooth shape and doing the same thing. All right. So let's see, how can we do this? Now in hers, she does a just a little like a... I'm actually going to raise the size of my... my pen here and again I'm, I'm, I'm putting blah, blah, blah. I am bringing down the size of my um, of my canvas here so I can I can just see all sides of it and no rotation guys that's cheating all right, so in her, she does something like, like this. It's like, um, yay. So I, then you, you take the same thing and then try to scale it. Rotate it. And, you know, in nature, there are very few rigid shapes. I mean, yeah, you've got trees that have straight sides, but even those aren't straight. So it's good to be able to, to view and, and draw Draw these shapes.
So this last uh, set of exercises that we're completing today, I'm probably not going to be revisiting it, revisiting it to make a, a video, um, but that doesn't mean don't revisit it. Um, definitely go back. Definitely go back and do these exercises over and over. These are like your foundation, right? They're stretching. If, you know, if, if you're doing uh, physical exercise, they're, they're, you know, if you're going to do a drawing, just noodle for, for 10 minutes. If you're, if you're kind of hanging out at home and, and you see an envelope on the table and it's clean, well, you know what? doodle on it why not we don't need no stinking clean paper especially if it's a bill right I like that one. That's kind of cute. I'm going to try to draw it this way. You can draw other ghosts too, or ghosts. Wow, my mind is just a little bit ahead of my voice here. It's, let's see, you can draw other shapes too. Like I was thinking like, uh, like little ghosts. All right, here we go, guys. There you have it. We're drawing the schmoo shapes. So, um, yeah, don't use uh, too many. I guess there are a couple places I uh, connected the lines with those hard 90-degree angles, but that's not the goal. Smooth shapes, natural nature like curvy and then repeat them you know be able to do the same thing over and over and over again at different sizes because you know uh, later on in the future if you're doing animation if you're doing uh, uh, if you're if you're doing um, like comics or, or anything you have to be able to draw the same character over and over and over again in different from different directions and in different um, scales and and you know from different angles so yeah this has helped you apparently helps you achieve that so yeah
All right. We'll go ahead and close for the day. Guys, keep getting better every day. Peace out.